Well, you know, NACOA is, a, a, is an organization that offers uh, health programs, housing programs, empowerment programs, and also uh, economic, uh, economic security programs. Within those programs, I direct, uh, within that uh, uh, spectrum of services, I, I, I direct, uh, and of course, all of this is teamwork in collaboration with uh, many of our uh, staff members, the, the health programs uh, at NACOA. Issues that we cover are, of course, uh, those that are most uh, prevalent in the Hispanic community in the United States and Puerto Rico, which, of course, are, are, are diabetes, hypertension, but just about anything that has to do with the senior aging, not just diseases, not just diseases like chronic diseases, but also health services. What kind of attention are they getting? Um, I should say that uh, most of the work that we do, uh, the lion's share of the work that we do, is through the uh, network of community-based organizations that are really the ones that provide the services directly to the seniors. The community, we have over 40 community-based organizations throughout the uh, U.S. mainland and also in Puerto Rico who provide services, direct service to the Hispanic community. That's how uh, the, the uh, National Hispanic Council of Aging is able to disseminate uh, the, the programs, grants, cooperative agreements that we receive.